everyone welcome back i will do another comparison video and you guys know from title it's gonna be compared for both popular bag one from louis vuitton pashel mati and the one from the coach cassie because i just purchased this handbag at the beginning of the, this month so i won't do a fully review for this handbag because i feel like uh, i only use uh, one week i should not give you full review but i will very briefly to talk about it and in this video i mainly wanted to do watch bag fits more so the second thing i wanted to do is the model shot which handbag do you prefer when you see i'm doing the model shot the third thing i wanted to do is i give you the six reasons why i purchased this handbag so without further ado let's get into today's video so very briefly to talk about this handbag and the handbag a lot of people said this is very similar to louis vuitton pashel mati yes from the handle you can see they are so so similar to each other i don't want to say who copies who each bag to me they are individual so I don't feel like this is a dupe of the Louis Vuitton and I do think that this one was the updated version of the core bag which was uh, coming out 1980s and the Louis Vuitton Pachon Matisse also updated from the Louis Vuitton Monk maybe my pronouns is not correct also around like 80s so therefore the Pashur Mati was updated from there. Uh, I will insert both pictures, you can take a look. That's the reason I would say there's no cop who copy who, it's uh, their own individual character. So I will do uh, very quickly to show you guys what can be fit actually i've been using this one uh, this morning uh when i went to the movie so i have a lot of things now i empty because i want to very briefly to show you what look like inside this is the handbag it has a turn lock this is the feature that i love the most because i do like this feature of the turn lock i really really don't like louis vuitton's click uh lock because sometimes you just can't find the the hole to click and it just and also it scratch everywhere i don't even understand that this one was made by uh like plastic but it can scratch the hardware so bad so i still have the uh protected uh, plastic protector on that because i this is my second handbag that i own uh, from louis vuitton pashama tea the the first one was the uh, uh, monogram so this is actually my second one so this is the feature i love the most when you open that you will see it's a fabric lining and the ha back has a one pocket which i put it for i forgot to take out the phone uh so the one pocket i normally put it on my cell phone and the zip pocket and the next to that there was another big compartment side has a small pocket and the front have another compartment back has a back pocket so this is the feature of this one this one you guys already know this is open like that is the uh it has a back has a pocket and the middle has a uh, big compartment because it's a block very not very easy to see it. and the front also have a big compartment and back there I had the zipper pocket both had a very similar handle in here as you can see so I just emptied this handbag and I was very surprised how much this handbag can be fit I'm gonna just show you what was in my bag so what I have I have here is my transportation card holder six key holder and the key clay which is have a lot of credit cards and i have the so you wallet so i will put everything into this handbag i have the key clay for coin purse as a coin purse i always use this key clay as a coin purse i'll show you right now it's like that everything in one compartment and then i also put the two uh, lipstick case 
next one is my company uh, access car with the, my front and I have the sunglasses this one Tom Ford and I have my reading glasses from the Tiffany car this one I have the 7 plus phone I put it back see this is how much I can put it into this handbag the easily I can close that it is so soft the leather I cannot believe I can hold can hold everything into this little one so now I'm gonna transfer this to Louis Vuitton Pichon Matisse you will see if everything can go there so right now it's everything here just like before put under the cap of course no problem it can fit everything there and I'm gonna put it there uh, my lipstick my reading glasses my sunglasses last one is my cell phone here is him, him. he come for my cell phone so I need to quickly finish this one <laughs> so, so I also can fit into this handbag and put this now basically as you can see those handbags can equally fit the uh, same amount of the stuff so here we go 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 now I forgot about my uh, company access card and I close like that so definitely both handbag can fit the same amount of the stuff like that you can see everything is there the both bag I don't use the back pocket one is the zipper one is the just back both of them I don't use so you do have more stuff can fit both handbags so the conclusion is both heaven can fit without any problem so the the both handbag strap I make the last uh, adjust the hole so this one I put the last one and this one also put the last one which is a little bit longer than Louis Vuitton if I make the maximum maximum longer so how much the difference oh, to the last one Louis Vuitton I also make the last one so now we can compare see a uh, coach is longer than the Louis Vuitton shroud so yeah so we finished the first part of the uh, comparison of capacity they basically the same uh, next one is I'm gonna give you the six reason why I purchased this one within those six reasons please let me know which one you disagree or which one you agree the first reason I purchased this one the price point now compare with the Louis Vuitton one and their they're from 350 to 395 so my version is 395 because the leather handle is the snake but the Louis Vuitton one is 2000 to 2600 so huge huge difference that's the first point price point price point coach is more affordable the second reason i don't know if you guys agree with me i feel coach quality has improved in this couple years and uh, i feel i don't need to worry about too much of the glazing or cracking so I feel when I wear this I feel very comfortable I want to say uh, when I wear this constantly I have to be aware uh, to be pay attention on the glazing part and uh, I was so afraid uh, when I was wear this bag is a swing and uh, end up have caused the problem on the cracking or glazing issue but when I wear this one 
I really never think about it. I don't. I don't need to watch all the pause. So I feel more free to wear this, and I also feel coach leather can hold up much longer than Louis Vuitton. Now maybe I was wrong. You can tell me what you think. You agree with me or you not? The reason is the look of the coach Cassie. I feel. More very classic that look much simplicity so do you agree with me or you are not and sometimes i do feel this one is a little bit too busy especially for this this one it just yeah the number four reason is i love the turn rock it's so easy in and out so this is also the reason I purchased this one when I look at this one. Oh, I feel like oh, such a relief. I don't need to, you know, to uh, struggling to close. And this one, you have to make sure you in the right place, you know. So that's also the downsides for this handbag. That's what I think. The number five I already mentioned is a carefree. Even though this is a white color, I don't need a too little bit of care about the color transfer. But for the glazing part, I really don't need to worry too much. And uh, I don't know if you guys just like me. I have to constantly check if there's anything wrong with this handbag. Now maybe it's because the price point this is an expensive bag. Of course, I need to care more. But for other Louis Vuitton handbag, I don't need to exam. I thought I see something. I don't need to exam constantly like this one. So this one, you guys already know, has a lot of issues from the beginning until now, still going on. But this one, I haven't really hear any negative sign of the quality part. So definitely, this is a wonderful reason. Number six, and also the last reason I purchased this is media inference. I totally totally agree because a lot of youtuber has this handbag it drive me to more attention uh, to this handbag and it started to growing on me more and more so finally i purchased this one so those are the six reasons i purchased this one I think no one will ask me which one I prefer. In case someone asks me which one I prefer, honestly, cannot give the answer. I purchased this one because of the combination of the uh, cameras, reverse monogram, and with, with the monogram, which is the only one uh, pieces in my collection. So that's why I want to have this one. And uh, the reason to purchase this one because the quality of the leather, I believe this one can hold many, many years and also the price point. So I don't need to worry too much than this one. Uh, honestly, when every time I wear this, I do have the worry feeling to have a glazing issue and the cracking those kind of feeling i have it but when i when i use this one i don't need to think about too much except the, the color transfer i do need to be caution you know i don't wear the jean or anything because i don't want to get the color transfer so the last part is the model shirt so i will show you guys how it goes to my frame and uh, which one you prefer and then you can take a look
that's it. That's all about today's video. I really hope you guys enjoy, and I really hope this comparison video also help you to make a decision which one to go. Thank you for your time to watch, and if you like this kind of video, if you like my channel, please consider subscribing. I upload a video two or three times a week, so I will see you very soon. Have a wonderful day. Bye bye.